Hi all, very happy morning, happy afternoon, happy evening to each and every viewer watching the video. In this session, we will discuss everything related to Tech Mahendra examination pattern. Tech Mahendra examination pattern. This is one of the companies where there is a pictorial test also that is conducted. We will see the high frequency topics that are asked in these examinations and we will also see the some important information related to Tech Mahendra placement process important for information these one company generally either it will go to the college and conduct an uh, campus interviews or they also conduct an off campus interviews good company to work with let us see the complete information Tech Mahendra conducts, checks a student's ability, right, in various rounds. Round 1 consists of a written test which has questions from quantitative aptitude, logical reasoning and verbal ability. And in round 2, there is a story writing as well as group discussion. And in round 3, there is a technical round. And round 4, there will be an HR interview. Right? HR interview is all about checking your confidence levels, your ability to answer the question confidently. And most importantly, what you wrote in the resume is what you are actually on a one-to-one. -one. So round 4 is more of a personality driven. Round 3 is more of understanding whether you are you have a very good knowledge on the technical things because that is what you are going to do the job. In round number two, story writing and group discussion. I will come to the story writing. In round one, quant logical reasoning and verbal. So there are, if I skip HR interview, there are total three sections and the test will be an adaptive test. Is there a, I think there was no negative marking. There was no negative marking. There, was, there is no negative marking. Now let us see. So, four rounds, round one online test, round two proficiency test, round three technical round and round four HR round. Let us discuss one by one each and every round. In round number one, there is one company where it gives you different sections under a particular sub main topic. Suppose if I take English, in English, there is English language general one. There is English gen language general 2 and there is an English language comprehension, right? And there is quantitative aptitude, logical reasoning is further divided into verbal reasoning general, verbal reasoning paragraph and non-verbal reasoning. There is one such company where it conducts an online test which has multiple sections in it, multiple sections in it. Now let us discuss what comes in each and everything. In round number 2. This is a new round added in the Tech Mahendra recruitment drive. In this round, what they do is they conduct a group discussion to check whether you are open to understanding and respecting the other people's point of view and also making your point clearly with data and facts. Now, this round also checks a student's communication skills among a group of students, right? And they also conduct a picture composition round they will give a picture to you and they will ask you to write about that picture right for about 10 to 15 minutes of a time there is a time allocated for a picture composition round so you are expected to see the positive side of the picture and they wanted to check your lateral thinking abilities by giving a picture to you any picture will be given suppose for example dot is given dot at the end of the line dot is the beginning of the universe dot 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 brahma vishnu maheshwara if i keep writing three dots at the end of the sentence that shows that so on and so forth like that the topic could be an abstract topic the topic could be a generic topic it is strongly recommended for students not to talk more about the negative side of it it may also show that you are a very pessimistic person show the optimistic side of yours so that is a picture composition round group discussion round as well as a picture composition round that will be a part of the round two proficiency test round two proficiency test in round number three they will check your technical interview now in the technical interview the questions will be on c or c plus plus and the questions very recently they are also asking questions on java and python 
they will ask you questions based on dbms fundamentals they will ask you questions based on operating system fundamentals they will ask you questions based on design and analysis of algorithms and computer networks fundamentals they might also ask you questions based on principles of programming languages and definitely please expect the questions from data structures definitely expect the questions from data structures here they will check your technical skills they will check whether you are able to understand a problem write an algorithm and generate a code for that algorithm generate a code for the algorithm that you developed they will also check you whether you have a fundamental understanding of what is required for a fresher to begin their journey in the professional life now round 3 technical interview and round 4 is hr round in hr round they will check your communication skills they will check your confidence levels they will also check whether you are a misfit for the company or you are a right fit for the company four rounds tech mahendra round four is hr round which is personality driven round three is a technical round round two is group discussion and picture writing round and round one is quant round one is quant verbal and reasoning now if you see here in round one quantitative aptitude almost every question that was coming in tech mahendra was mostly from arithmetic almost all from arithmetic so focus 95 percentage of the questions that were coming in tech mahendra paper are from arithmetic don't ignore this topic this is one area where you need to have an extreme expertise for you to clear the quant part of it as i told you english section is divided into multiple section english section general one in english section general one the questions will be mostly from grammar the questions will be mostly from grammar if you see tenses and everything except one topic which is para jumbles and para completion so we can say that it is 90 percentage grammar driven and 10 percentage verbal logic driven verbal logic driven right everything with respect to grammar and verbal logic one word substitution fill in the blanks these in these general two they will ask you questions based on vocabulary and subject to verb agreement there were also few questions based on critical reasoning last two years so that also is an extreme thing general one grammar and verbal logic general two vocabulary plus subject to verb agreement or critical reasoning these general english reading comprehension where you have to read a passage understand the passage read the question and answer the passage based on what is there in the passage there are four passages that will be given english is divided into three subsections general one general two and comprehensive section if you see the logical reasoning if you see the logical reasoning questions are coming from cubes and questions were also coming from clocks and calendars clocks and calendars there will also be a questions based on visual reasoning where a diagram will keep rotating clockwise or on anti-clockwise after four rotations we have to say fifth rotation where the the pictures which are present in that table it will be moving number series questions are there blood relations questions are there statement and assumption questions are there statement and conclusion based questions are there concentrate more on analytical reasoning analytical reasoning topics concentrate more on logical reasoning topics and also on the inductive reasoning topics these are the three areas where you should focus more for you to clear the written test part of tech mahendra logical i hope it is clear grammar 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 is a part of a subsection verbal logic is included in uh, in grammar section general to vocab subject verb agreement and critical reasoning and comprehension quantitative aptitude almost all the questions are from arithmetic in case if you are a student who wants to learn almost all the shortcuts which we developed from 15 years you can go through these placement crt course which is close to 350 plus hours of content it contains everything related to aptitude reasoning and verbal we also 
kept few videos based on resume and do's and don'ts of group discussion and personal interview you can watch the content in laptop desktop or also on the mobile app and the best thing is if you buy the course you will also get access to live classes arithmetic you will get access to live classes arithmetic and you can purchase it at a very affordable cost of 750 rupees for one month or in case if you want to go for three months 2400 rupees for three months six months it is 4500 and 12 months it is 5947 you can choose the validity depending upon your plan of action i hope tech mahendra paper pattern is clear to you i hope you are learning a lot through these placement series special series where i will take a company and i'll tell you the examination structure of that company in case if you enjoy the video click on the like button and you can share it to every friend of yours who probably is missing out a right guide guidance in terms of the course thanks a lot for watching the video with love anil nayar